G'day legends. Well, it's been a bit of a busy weekend. I had a pretty full on day yesterday um, introducing the uh, Restore Passenger Rail to New Zealand meeting in Dunedin, which was a uh, roaring success. Absolutely packed. Extra chairs had to be brought in and had some really um, good people there and really good discussion and an excellent presentation by Dr. Duncan Connors. So, bit tired from that, a bit of a uh, busy evening after that as well, I had to go straight from that meeting and went out again, so I didn't get home until quite late, so just having a bit of a rest up today, but I have got up a little bit early, and I gave the um, DC just a wee bit of a um, wipe down, just to get the spider webs off it, and any grime and um, dust that sort of settled on it, I like to try and keep it clean and keep on top of it and I just use one of those um, <coughs> excuse me microfiber cloths they seem to work really well so that's what I've been doing in the last half hour or so so I've decided this week because I've been a bit slack and had quite a lot on not been able to get a lot done that I will start using these bits and pieces I've got here so these end clips big bucket full of them and these bolts here so these these clips and I'm going to be using them down <clears throat> on the coal mine line down the bottom here so I've got half of it bolted down with where I have got rail and I still need to go and pick up that 40 pound rail which I haven't done yet as well kind of quite reliant on people helping me because obviously it's quite heavy and it's just not the sort of thing I can do safely on my own um, so Kinda have to work around other people as well. So what I've done here, I need to do right down the end. So we'll walk down over where the bridge will be. Here's our chickens that keep getting out and digging up all the ballast, which annoys me no end. Nothing like coming home from a day's work and having to scoop up <coughs> 20 buckets of ballast the chickens have um, dug out. Anyway, so what I will be doing, for example here, is drilling a um, hole here. And basically this end clip, um, oh, this one's a bit different to the normal ones I use, but it will sit like that. And the bolt will go through it, and it will hold it down. So if I pretend this hole is where the track's going to be, which it isn't, but um, just basically would screw down into there. So there'd be one there, and one on that side as well. And that would be replicated from where these ones are, all the way down here, down here, past my feet, and all the way down to the very end, and probably need to top up a bit of rail there, to the yard limits. So. I'm going to try and get that done in this next few days, get all the holes drilled, that won't take too long, it's more actually screwing them in because I do it by hand and it's actually quite hard work and takes quite a while, so that is my plan. Um, so quite a bit to do and of course ticking away in, my back, in the background I have my DG cab which I have to uh, arrange a flat deck truck um, which I will hire from Dunedin and take that up to Waimati and then um, load the locomotive cab onto the truck, weighs about two and a half ton roughly, and then bring it back to Dunedin. So it's going to be quite busy all round. So I hope everyone's having a great weekend and resting. So, if you like my videos, hit the subscribe button and hit the like button. Thank you.